Are you one of those people that will always find something to do apart from looking after you? Little poet and I didn't know it. But do you understand what I mean? I talk to a lot of people who will basically put other people first. And as much as I've made videos about time and time management and spending time wisely on yourself, this video is slightly different. And it's about thinking about yourself. So many conversations that I have with potential clients and clients is that one of the biggest issues that they find for themselves is that they don't put themselves number one. They actually feel guilty if they're not doing things for other people. They're running around for everybody else but not putting themselves first. And I understand and appreciate totally that if you've got a family, then more than likely your family comes first. But then somewhere along the lines is that what happens when something happens to you? What happens when you start feeling either quite sad or even depressed, thinking that things are not moving in the right direction for you and you've got so much that you'd like to achieve and you're just not getting around to doing it. And it's simply because is that you're just not making time for you. You'll find the time for other people. You'll go out of your way to help anybody else. But when it comes down to you, is that that whole guilt thing of, oh, well, hang on a second, I can't really do that for me because I can't really spend time or money or effort on me because, and it's normally because you're doing things for other people. So my suggestion is to you, and this is it's probably gonna sound really selfish, but the fact is that you have to t you have to find time to figure out what it is that you want with your life and the best ways of obviously getting it. Now the tip here, and there's always a little tip in the videos, is that get other people on board. If those people near and dear to you are sort of struggling with some things that they're finding hard, or they're the ones that want the attention, then get them involved in things that you want to do. So let's say for example, if you want to get healthy, then suggest that all the family go out for a walk. Suggest that you all go out on a bike ride. Suggest that you all do something, but maybe with health in mind. If you want to go out for a meal, then look for somewhere that maybe has got healthy options um, and incorporate that in what it is that you want to achieve, not just for you, but again, when you find that you get other people involved and they start buying into what it is that you want to do, it's going to be an easier process. So there's me little take home message for today, just over three minutes long. Hopefully you got something out of that. If you did, then give it a like. If you didn't, then don't. Not a major hassle. I just hope, in my hope of hopes, that these videos help you in some way. Have a great day and I look forward to speaking to you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.